This video for 2020 is made by Mark Dewar 777. Today is a double rant on Turkle Inc. Rebel and the Haunted World of El Super Bisto. If you like any of those movies, I can handle your opinion as long as you can handle mine. First, let's rant on Turkle in Trouble. Enjoy. This movie has got to be the worst movie ever of 2004 next to Saw 1, Soul Plane, You Got Served, and Bad Education. I will explain the reasons why I hate this film. The movie was rated R for offensive language, alcoholic drugs, child abuse and way more inappropriate and violent I don't materials you can think of. And yes, you can call me a hypocrite, because I like Deadpool, Logan, Joker, The Terminator, Halloween and Matrix, which these movies are all rated R. The animation is very gruesome, as it looks so poorly made. Some of the scenes may be so horrendous to look at. There was a lot of uncomfortable scenes that don't really entertain me. Also, I don't understand why it got 7.1 on IMDb. Thankfully, it got an 40% on Rotten Tomatoes. Thank goodness I never see it in cinemas. Because I'm only 14. This this movie is classified as age 15. Even though I'm turning 15 in 2021. But anyways. That's all I would like to say for rant number one. The next one is on the haunted world of El Super Bisto. Enjoy. This is the worst movie of 2009 next to Knowing, Saw 6, Final Destination 4, Gamer, 2012 The movie, Bruno, Law Abiding Citizen and Easier with Practice. I will tell you reasons why. Look at the animation of this. Hideous. Right? This movie involves a bunch of disturbing scenes, I like it's trying to be a much more results for a version of South Park, bigger, longer, and uncut, written by Rob Zombie and Tom Papa. No wonder why this movie got an 5.9 on IMDb and 40% on Rotten Tomatoes. Heck, Konstantino Danikovo would be watching this movie millions of times if he wanted to, because Konstantin doesn't even appreciate good content. And Constantine Odin Okovo sucks super ultra hard as well. The animation is an abomination. The music is disturbing. The characters look like they are all high on crack. Thank goodness I never watched it, never even tried to watch it. And I never will watch it. Or else it will literally have killed me to death. Anyways. That's all I would like to say for this double rant. So. If you have a request for me. Let me know in the comments. This is Mark Dewar 777. Peace out.